Well, good morning, or possibly afternoon or evening, as I'm not sure exactly when you're watching this, but it's morning when I'm recording it. Uh, hi there, I'm Michael Barber. I'm your instructor for um, Education 716, uh, Reading and Writing Educational Literature. Uh, so we're going to be meeting up in the uh, with the Vacaville cohort, so it's up in Vacapenny Middle School. Um, you can actually watch the syllabus video that uh, we have up in Google Classroom, so that'll give you some more information about it. Um, but I wanted to introduce myself a little bit. I know we had a chance to meet uh, back in, uh, it was either late November or early December when I came and visited your class, but I wanted to sort of introduce myself once again. So um, I'm here coming to you from my office down here at Torrey University of California on Mare Island. Um, so uh, you can sort of see some of the trappings of it, and I mentioned that just because uh, since you guys are located up in the Vacaville Fairfield area and uh, we're going to be having class up in Vacaville. Chances are most of you likely will never actually come and uh, meet with me in my office so uh, this may be one of the few chances that you get to see it. So as you can see, uh, you know, well, here's some of it anyway, the back part of it as you can uh, tell I'm a proud Georgia Bulldog, um, go dogs. Um, proud alumni of the University of Georgia because that's where I actually got my uh, PhD uh, in instructional technology um, and after that I went to uh, Wayne State University which is in Detroit, Michigan although being a native Canadian I lived over on the Canadian side of the border in Windsor, Ontario. Uh, after six years there I moved to Sacred Heart University in Fairfield, Connecticut which was a uh, private Catholic university uh, my first um, experience uh, dealing with uh, any sort of uh, private schooling, actually, either at the K-12 or at the higher ed level. Uh, all of my own K-12 experience um, had been public schooling, as well as all of my own university experience had been uh, from public schools. So uh, that was quite interesting, and I joined the faculty here at Torrey University of California this past September. So I've been here since, essentially, Labor Day. Um, so uh, I'm originally from Newfoundland, Canada, and um, there's an old saying where I come from, you can always tell the Newfoundlanders in heaven they're the ones that still want to go home, and uh, I think that's very true of, of most folks from the island. Um, you know, their end goal, regardless of where in the world you happen to meet them, and in your case you're happening to meet this Newfoundlander in California, um, their end goal is to uh, one day find a way to live and or work back home. Um, not that I'm hoping to do it anytime soon, um, having just moved to California, I have to say that uh, I'm loving living on the west coast. Uh, California living really agrees with me it seems, uh, as it does my wife, and uh, so we're rather enjoying ourselves here, so we hope to spend a good deal of time here. Uh, hopefully, you know, the next decade or two is kind of what we're talking about. Anyway, um, that's a brief introduction to me. Hopefully, um, I'll get to see everyone in a couple of weeks when class starts. Um, if you're not able to make any classes, please let me know in advance. Um, you'll note that I've got a lot of materials put up in Google Classroom, and there's going to be a video there that sort of walks you through where to go and what to find. But much of it is things that I've recorded over the years um, as I've been teaching similar courses at other institutions. So uh, while you'll get most of the things if you're unable to attend any of the classes, there are some things that you would likely not get from it. Um, so you know, do make an effort to be there, and I hope to see you all, um, I guess, at the end of the month, on the 26th. So until then, um, feel free to get a hold of me if you've got any questions, comments, or concerns, and I will see you in a few Thursdays.